Hello everyone, I'm Fairzell and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Dream Survival and I know it's been a long time since we made an episode, I think it's been like three days and I wasn't able to record for some reason but now I'm I, every single day I was like, oh I want to record now but I couldn't but I have done some stuff since the last episode and I will show you guys now um, one thing I don't have in my inventory it is the rod that I got I enchanted a, um, a, what do you call it, a fishing rod I call it the super rod and with it, well, I had Luck of the Sea 2, Lore 2, and Unbreaking 2. And I used that to fish out one that was exactly the same as the one I had. And then I just combined them, and now I have Unbreaking 3, Lore 3, and Luck of the, uh, <laughs> Luck of the Sea 3. And it's pretty awesome, although all I got till now is actually a whole bunch of fish. I haven't got much. Oh yeah, I was just playing on a, on a prison server. That's what I've been doing these last couple of days. And yeah, yeah I, we have a new door here, which is awesome. But anyway, we were playing. Well, I, there's so many updates, and I'm trying to show you guys, tell you guys something at the same time. Here are cows. Okay, before we before we go on, I'm gonna stay in the house. And what I was doing is I was playing on a prison server. Some of you guys might know this person I'm about to talk about. His name is Strawberry Jam, one of my favorite YouTubers. Um, he's playing on this prison server. It's called Smexy Prison, and I've been playing on it, and it's really fun. And you guys want to come onto that server the IP will be in the description uh, I don't know if I'm gonna make a video on it or not but for now we're just gonna stick to dream survival and maybe we'll make some videos about that too that'd be pretty cool and also yeah I'm gonna harvest that later actually I might do that right now while we talk it's not like any I have anything else to do Wee. I don't know if I showed you guys this yet I have this little waterfall now so I can get back down pretty easily and I've been playing on this server, and the cool thing is, like, the, our favorite YouTuber, or one of my favorite YouTubers is playing on it, so that's one w that's one reason I'm playing on it, and it's actually really fun, and I was playing on it, and what interested me is that, till now, I think I, I think, oh, my, <laughs> my thing is full, let's get rid of some andesite, and some cobblestone, okay, and what interested me was that, Actually, I found some of my subscribers playing on that server, which is really, really cool. So some people recognize me and say, yay, I love your art. And that, that made me really happy, notice, noticing that some people that are subscribed to me, I find, I find on other servers. That's really, that's really cool if you're on a server and then someone recognizes you. That, that's just amazing. And I hope for that to happen more commonly in the future. Well, I'm going to pick that back up, get rid of the sand. Okay, here we go. That that was just a up moment for me, and that was just that was just like 20 minutes ago, <laughs> and now I'm recording the next episode of Minecraft Frame Survival, and I'm gonna get rid of this sugar cane real quick. Where do I have my chests? I have them here. Okay, <laughs> I almost forgot because I haven't played this in two days. I think I haven't recorded in three days and I haven't played this in two days. Actually, I might have played it yesterday. I don't know, but I haven't played it very much, and. I think you guys caught a glimpse of it earlier, but I continued building the village, and this stuff takes up a lot of gravel, actually. All this gravel that's laying around here is more than three stacks, probably. And we moved our villager into here, and he sells paper. I don't know if I showed you guys the trades yet, but he sells paper. It's a pretty bad trade because there's so much paper, but still, it's pretty decent. And books. I think I unlocked all the trades, but I'm not sure. And then power 3 for 31 emeralds. I think I have to get that to unlock the next trade. Because I think it might go on. I'm stuck here. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm in the very newest snapshot. Um, there's some features that you can use. I'm not going to use it in this world, but there's one feature that I really like a lot. It's the game mode, uh, the spectating game mode, which is called game mode 3. And it's basically no clip. And if you guys know know what no clip is it's basically you can fly through bo blocks and you can you can basically see through the to the ground if you're in the ground you can see as if you have a chunk error so you can see what's underground and stuff so if you want to do some kind of seed showcase you can always go into no clip and then you just see what you need oh yeah also um here is my bow 
It's called Dream because I think it's the most powerful thing you can get. Except, no, it doesn't have punch. It doesn't have power 5. But it has power 4, infinity 1, which is why I only need one arrow. Unbreaking 2 and flame 1. So technically, I can actually go to these cows over here. Which is what I'm going to do right now. But I'm... Oh, this is the wrong way. Ah, uh, this way. Oh, yeah, and um, if you guys are wondering what this is, how this works, by the way, is I have a redstone torch here. Turn this on. And if I activate this stone block, then it deactivates this torch, and the piston goes back down. And I'm using this new carpet trick. Well, it's probably not new anymore. <laughs> it was pretty new to me. I'm using the carpet trick to be able to walk on a torch. So, And you don't suffocate if it puts you up, you just fall into the piston. So that's pretty cool. So now if I want to just kill some cows, I can just go bam, and they'll burn to death. And it's nice for XP. I'm not going to kill too many, but if I want some food, I can just go on to that. Got some XP, some food. I think I got five extra steaks. Whoa, I got more than five. Now I got at least ten. Well, I got a lot of steak. And you guys can see the skelly spawner over there. And I think we have this house pretty much finished except for the roof at the back. I'm having this closed because I don't want him walking out quite yet. We don't have a huge... <laughs> well, as soon as this village is done, we're going to have a huge um, a wall all around. Have everything lit up so that no zombies can come inside. Here's one of the um, more um, lower class houses. And then here I made myself a blacksmith. I don't have any lava yet. And I think this is not... I'm not sure if this is in the right position, but it looks like it. I don't have any lava yet. I can get some, but I don't need to right now. Do something like that off camera. Um, I might still want to put a chest there. I can do that now. I can do that right now. Bam, bam, yay. And we have this in the way. So, let's put this chest here. I finished this today, actually. So, I did actually play today, but not very much. I didn't pay attention. Oh, yeah, Diamond Sword is Knockback 2, Sharp Mystery. Not the best, but it's pretty good against creepers, I guess. And we have the gentleman pickaxe. And <laughs> I called it the gentleman because it has silk touch on it. And it's efficiency 4 with unbreaking 3, which is pretty good. Wait, uh, wait is it? Efficiency 4. Okay, yeah. And what's really good about it is if we go downstairs. It's going to take a while because we have to go down the ladder. I have so much stuff. There's not. Wait, I'm going to I'm going to deposit some stuff first. Because I actually planned on building this episode, but right now I'm actually showing you all the updates. So I'm going to get rid of all the stuff that I have in my inventory. And I hope I can unlock the paper trade again so I can use all my sugarcane. And I think everything I have on me is blocks, actually. So block, block, block. I'm going to get rid of all the days. That's not a block. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And iron bars. Uh, I might use that on our wall design. Although the wall is going to be pretty big. That would cost a lot of iron. Never mind. And let's get rid of some of this. And I think I'll leave it like that. Um, oh yeah, oh, you guys are probably wondering, what's this? Uh, that's also part of the new update. You can make chiseled stone blocks now. That's pretty cool. And still, I have plenty of sh um, cows. And I really have to make a better wheat farm or bigger wheat farm. I, I, the reason I'm not doing it is because I'm always thinking, oh yeah, I got, I got lots of bone meal. I, I don't need to worry about it. But... Still, even if you have bone meal, you always have to bone meal it, then you have to break it, and then you have to bone meal it again, which takes a while. I'm not sure if this hut is 100% accurate, and I forgot we're going downstairs again. We've been recording for about 8 minutes and 50 seconds, plus the intro, that makes it about 9 minutes. Whoa, <laughs> the chicken almost figured out how to get up and escape. That would not have been good. And I don't think I've explained, uh, explored this entire cave yet. So I guess I'm going to check that out. Yeah, I don't have to go to the very bottom. Oh, yeah, and I found some lapis because we were out of lapis. And now I have some more. Oh, yeah, and as you can see, we are getting stone now instead of cobblestone. Which is pretty cool because that means we don't have to smelt any cobblestone in order to get the stone. And we do have a lot of durability on this. So if I do like that, I still have the same amount. And that's because of the unbreaking three. It's pretty cool. I can't remember the percentage anymore. I used to know all this stuff about Minecraft. Oh, hello there. Time for you to burn. Didn't expect that underground. And I'm low on torches. I didn't bring any wood. 
Yeah, I'm gonna need some wood for that. Because we are gonna do a lot of mining. No, no, no. Um, we're just gonna do a little bit of mining right now. We're just gonna check this out because we want to build. We don't want to be mining all that. So we're just gonna look around and see if we can find something nice. Because if we find something nice, then that'd be pretty nice, like some diamonds. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, skeleton? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. He knows what I'm saying. It's a mistake. Um. There's not going to be any diamonds if we go upstairs. And we're out of torches. That means we have to go back. Oh, let's check this out one last time. Is there anything in... Okay, this is pretty interesting. I'm going to go towards the lava so you guys can see something. <gasps> Enderman. I don't wish Enderman. <gasps> Diamond! 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 Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> we're going to... Cover up the lava. Be nice and safe. Ooh, three. Uh, more, 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 more. <laughs> I wonder if they can pick up uh, diamond ore blocks. I'm not sure. I know they can pick up normal diamond blocks. Too bad we don't have fortune. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, we get the ore. But I need this gravel, too. I'm going to collect some gravel, guys, real quick. Might take a while. <laughs> I'm just going to collect what's ever here. I'm not going to go too deep into this because I don't want to take too long. We're recording for like 12 minutes now. Not even. So we still have another 10 minutes to record. That's great. Because I don't want to make any longer than 20 minutes. Oh, and uh, if you guys know Think Noodles, he's also a YouTuber. I think he has like two, 200k subs now. Uh, he announced some guy, I can't remember his name, like Mike, Mike something. <laughs> some guy, um, uh, pretty, m uh, yeah, <laughs> I think it was like 600 subscribers, and he made this new thing. Like he he wasn't very into UHC and stuff. Uh, his first name is Mike. I can't remember the last one, but basically he made this challenge. It's called the Hardcore Challenge. I think it's called the MHC. I don't know what the M stands for, but H and C is Hardcore Challenge. And I and basically that's a monthly thing that he does on his channel and people can join it on their single player world and they make a series on it and they post Mondays and Fridays and he looks at them and then he posts uh, he chooses the winner at the end of the month and I'm lost and I'm not sure where I'm going is that a villager zombie? yeah it is and I have no torches so uh, you guys probably can't see very well I should get out of here oh this is where I was. Okay, so if I walk down this way, I might find the way out. And basically, it's a challenge that is a monthly challenge. For example, live underground. And that's, that's the one for this uh, this month is live underground. Don't do damage to passive mobs or something like that. So that's pretty interesting. I might actually do that. The thing I don't like is that you can only post on Mondays and Fridays. I see the point, because if he has 100 people watch, uh, doing videos, and they're all posting 20-minute episodes every single day, there's no way he can look at all of them and choose a winner, or just look at all of them in total, because that would take way too long. So I like to keep a consistent <laughs> upload schedule. It's kind of hypocritical, because I didn't have anything in the last three episodes, uh, for the last three days, but still. I might join that. If you guys want to leave some feedback on that, I'll leave a link in the description if I remember. And this is where we came up earlier. I'm going to try to get back up now because downstairs in the mines is not the place to be. Uh, how do I get back up? Oh, I remember these mushrooms. Here's a ladder. Yay. Let's get back up, guys. And Speedheart. Speedheart's, guys. Yeah, I didn't make one last week. This week, sh I should make another one this week, but I'm so lazy. <laughs> I'm so lazy, guys. But I know it would help me a lot, and I know you guys enjoy speed arts. So, we're going to have to make myself a speed art tomorrow for somebody. And by the way, um, <laughs> one more reason why I have to make speed arts is I have to make 100 speed arts in total. I have to get to episode 100 because I see the speed arts as a series, partially. And the sun's going down, so we're going to go back upstairs. I partially see the, uh, the speed arts as a series. 
And once I have 100 um, episodes of that, that's going to be the final. And then I can redo people if I want. So basically, I want to have 100 different YouTubers and make speed arts of them. And once that's over, I can, I can draw my subscribers or something. I can redraw people that I've drawn in the past, for example. For example, I drew uh, Strawberry Jam, if you know him, and that was not one of my most advanced speed arts. And I know that in the future, when I get better, I might want to redo him. So, well, we didn't sleep yet. Okay, let's go back into bed. Oh, yeah, that's a good sleep. Mm. Ah, yes, I refreshed and ready. Oh, yeah, and we, we either put this iron ore. No, wait, this diamond ore. Actually, we might just place it because it looks really nice. And you don't really see that. Um, you don't see this a lot above ground. So we're going to leave this here, a little diamond pillar. We might actually build out of that. Going to have to sacrifice some diamonds and build a little thing in our house. Some kind of monument. Monument. Although it's not a momentum monument. Nothing to remember or anything. Oh yeah, and I guess what we can do now is we can continue to build on this village. Which means we are going to get ourselves all the gravel we have. Oh, I have coal ore too. None of this got mine, did it? That sucks. I mean, it's kind of nice, but at the same time, it sucks. Oh, gravel. Let's get all the gravel we have. And we're going to need some more cobblestone for this because that's the main ingredient in our, in our build. Some more gravel. Cobblestone, some more cobblestone, please. Here, here's some more co Oh yeah, that's plenty. That's plenty of cobblestone. And one thing that I'm actually low on is um, oak wood. I think I started planting it somewhere on the other side of the house, of course. <laughs> I might bring some of it over real quick if I can get a sapling, and I can grow on this side too because there's a lot of space. Although I do plan on making the village quite a bit bigger than a normal village would be. And maybe I might get rid of all of the sugarcane because it is kind of in the way. And it doesn't look very nice when there's tender sugarcane. We got about three more minutes, but we can extend this episode by about another three minutes. If we want to. Because cool episodes are long. Ep wait, long episodes are cool episodes. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Now that we got this, we're gonna. Um. Yeah, we're just gonna leave it. Hope we get. S hope we get back in time for some saplings. By by the end of the episode, we're gonna get some saplings, and then we'll grow off camera, some time. So we don't have a lot of oak wood. We do not have a lot of oak wood. Let's check. Uh, oh, we do have some oak wood over here, and... Oh, we, we do have a lot of oak wood. I take that back. We have a lot of oak wood. I thought... Mm, I don't know the exact way that the houses are supposed to look. <laughs> He's trying to get out. No, Mr. Villager, no out of you. And I guess I'm place some gravel over here. Because I do want to connect this... Let's do it right here. I need to get myself some diamond tools. Or I need to enchant my my shovels. But the thing is, it costs so much um, lapis. And lapis is not that common. I shouldn't have put that there. Oh, I'm out of shovel -ness. But That sucks. I'm going to place all this gravel real quick. And we have ourselves a nice little road. Oh yeah, guys, and um, whether I do the um, the the challenge, the hardcore challenge, is up to me. And whether I do the prison server, uh, a video on the prison server is up to you guys. If you guys want to see a prison server, then awesome. Although then again, it's going to be pretty difficult to commentate when you're just mining and doing stuff. Although I have a shop. I have a shop on that th on that server. And it's pretty cool. It's pretty smartly done. Or pretty intelligently done. 
and I like it. Oh, we're gonna build another house. So let's get going on this. Um, we're gonna have another one of those cobblestone frames. So we're just gonna build it randomly. Oh, that's not cobblestone. Get one of those cobblestone frames, and let's get building. Um, I noticed this was too high apparently, uh, from what I've seen, and that means I can only make this, this high. And I think you only get two wooden blocks. I can't remember. So let's get going. Oh, I don't want to make it too big. It was this is way too big. For example, so. Uh, we're gonna <laughs> conveniently end it right there. No, we're not. That would that would suck. Oh, it's been 20 minutes already. No, it's gonna be a long episode. We're all out of shovel. That means I can't dig away any dirt. But I guess we don't need to. Although this one looks kind of choppy. Boom. And we're gonna make one of those L-shaped ones that <laughs> I've seen. Just gonna make it a little bit like this, and that's good enough. So we're gonna close this off real quick. And the door is going to be right here. And we're still gonna have the frames on the side though. Okay, I almost got confused and put them there. That would not have been good. And we're probably not gonna finish this, this episode. I'm going to have to look at the design of a normal village again, if I can find one somewhere, Google Images, and then we're going to do this, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do it good. And for the sake of not having to render this too long, I might just end off the episode right here. Oh yeah, we're going to collect those saplings, aren't we? Yeah, we don't want to forget, we don't want to forget those saplings. So let's go get them saplings, guys. For the fun of it. We do oh, that sucked. But still, we killed one. That's good. And we collected their steak. What's burning? Oh, that's that's my arrow that I shot. So I hope they didn't despawn it, but I doubt that it's been five minutes. Well, it might have actually been five minutes since they all fell. Yeah, we got ourselves some apples and some saplings. And that's some pretty sweet awesomeness. So I think this is where we can end off the episode, guys. And I will see you guys next time.